The toxin in this mushroom with a human face is 100 times stronger than that of a black mamba. Just touching this mushroom would cause instant death. However, after this man took a bite, toxin spread throughout his body, but he showed no reaction at all. In fact, he even won 70 points in a gourmet betting game. This was a food betting competition, where the winner could make any wish come true, while the loser would have their brain drained. The rules of the game were incredibly cruel. The winner had to flip a card, and by eating the food corresponding to the card, they would earn the points shown on the card. But if they didn't eat it or discarded the card, the corresponding points would be deducted. If the same card was flipped consecutively, they could continue flipping. The maximum number of flips was three rounds. On the surface, this appeared to be a game to enjoy food. But in reality, most of the foods were highly toxic. If not handled carefully, they would kill the person who ate them. When the game began, Coco chose to flip the first card. With her predictive abilities, Coco easily scored 40 points for Team Toriko. Next, it was the evil chef's turn to flip a card. Unexpectedly, he flipped a 50-point sausage worm. This worm could easily pierce through a person's stomach. But with his special preparation, the evil chef ate the worm effortlessly. Then, he flipped a mushroom with a human face, worth 70 points. Despite its potent toxicity, the evil chef tossed the mushroom into his bowl. Soon, he showed an expression of pleasure, and quickly ate the mushroom, turning this dangerous fungus into a delicacy. Next, he flipped an extremely acidic melon worth 100 points. When the melon was brought over, he immediately sliced it open and ate it in one go. After one round of flipping cards, the evil chef's team had a 180-point lead. This point gap forced them to flip high-value ingredients, so Coco used his ultimate ability. He could easily tell the value of a card by its color, but Coco made Toriko promise to eat whatever food was on the card, no matter what. Once Toriko agreed, Coco began flipping the cards. Unexpectedly, the first two cards he flipped were both worth 150 points each puddings. In an instant, a massive mountain of pudding appeared before them. The evil chef grinned slyly, because if Toriko couldn't finish all the pudding in 150 minutes, his head would be immediately removed.